Okay, so you've had blended vision, either in the form of laser vision correction or lens-based surgery. So removing your human lens, implanting a new lens, and you've gone through the four phases. Remember the wow, the rivalry, the suppression, and you're supposed to be at the blend phase after six to nine months, but you're struggling, or three or six months you're struggling. A lot of people do, and that's normal. When you get to this point, it's important to start considering brain training exercises. So now we've got to try and teach our brain to rewire the eye that it doesn't need for a certain distance. Let's give an example. So I'm sitting reading and my right eye has been set for distance and my left eye is set more for the computer and reading. But when I'm reading, I'm still getting image blur. I'm still feeling a little uncomfortable. So with these brain training exercises, which is the same as trying to shift gear from first to second and use your accelerator and clutch, what you're trying to do is tell your brain that you don't need visual impulse for your right side, for your right eye. So when you're reading, take your right hand, cover your right eye, your distance eye, and start reading. You're going to notice it's clear because the left eye has been set then for your near vision activities. Read for two or three minutes. What you're telling your brain is to fire all the impulses, all the visual impulses to the left eye. After two to three minutes, take your hand away. It's not going to be immediate. When we trained for ophthalmology, we had to learn to use the left and the right eye and dissociate them completely, depending on which eye of the patient we were looking into. That took me months. And it's the same with blended vision. So cover that eye, and then after two or three minutes, take it away. And then cover it again, and take it away. What you're telling your brain to do is to switch off the visual impulse to the right eye for the near activity. When you're going to look up for a far away activity, so anything beyond three meters, you do the opposite. You then cover the left eye, look up, and now you're telling your brain to wire all the impulses to the right eye for distance. And then after two or three minutes, you take your hand away. So, once your brain starts learning this, remember the brain is plastic. Plastic means it's moldable. It's going to have the ability to learn how to use the left and the right eye for different visual tasks and how to learn to suppress and switch off those images. It doesn't really switch it off so that it goes blank, but it switches the fuzz off so that your brain processes it out. It doesn't see that anymore. So if you do these brain training exercises enough, depending on the visual distances you're using, you will eventually get to the point where you're moving from first to second gear with the clutch and accelerator and you don't even know what you're doing. So that is called true blended vision. But it's a process that can take time, but that's what we're here for as well. That's what my team is here for too. We counsel you through this process thoroughly. And if you need help getting through the brain training phase and the neuro adaptation phase, that's what we can do for you. But this video should really give you some insight into how you can help yourself at home do that.